This video is sponsored by Trugo Republic, the precious metals experts. Talk to one of their experts today about diversifying your portfolio to help assure your future financial security. Find their contact information in the description below and pinned in our first comment. James Kaufman, World News Report today, May 18th, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, for some reason I said miles per hour when I met miles per year in my last update about the pole flip. So I'm going to redo it. I can't live with a work like that. All right, according to NOAA and the National Centers for Environmental Information, we're seeing a pole movement. And that means the North Pole and South Pole, magnetic poles, that is. So, ladies and gentlemen, Earth's northern magnetic pole in 1900 was somewhere in northern Canada. And it's been moving since then. And we'll watch it kind of move a little bit together. As you can see it's moved through Antarctica. And it's actually in Siberia officially now. And you'll see that called out on another highlighted informative uh, chart here. So it's moving at about 7 miles per year. And it should meet the Southern Pole somewhere north of Indonesia. Well, at some point. It is accelerating slightly every year. And at some point it might accelerate and move very quickly. Again, this is our northern magnetic pole. It's moved from Canada all the way across to northern Siberia in Russia. All right, this is our southern pole. According to NOAA, the National Center for Environmental Information, it too is moving around 7 miles per hour and accelerating. This was 1900. This is Antarctica here. You'll see that it moves towards Australia. Some people say that it's on Australia. Some people also say that the North Pole has already moved as far south as Russia. So, ladies and gentlemen, what happens when a negative hits a positive? I really thought that they would flip in opposite directions, but it looks like they're going to meet just north of Indonesia, and we'll call that the Big Bang. So you can see this is moving up towards Australia, although I have seen maps that say that this is already on the Australian continent. I've also seen maps saying that the North Pole is already on the Russian continent. All right, one last quick pictorial that kind of proves it. This is 1900 here, and we've seen the Northern Pole, magnetic pole that is, drift all the way through Antarctica and really into Siberia. And you can see just Four years ago, it wasn't quite into Siberia proper yet. So in just four years, we've moved quite some distance here. Again, we're supposed to be moving at seven miles per year, but that speed is supposed to be increasing. What happens when a positive meets a negative? Well, you tell me in the comments below. God bless you guys. Sorry, I did say miles per hour before. Please share, subscribe, and always remember anything's possible in Bizarro World.